in terms of uh, what is being done by the government of Kenya katika kikao na waziri wa ulinzi Eugene Wamalwa kamati ya usalama na masuala ya mambo ya nje imetaka kujua hatma ya kesi ya mawaja Agnes Wanjiru yanayodaiwa kutekelezwa na wanajeshi wa Uingereza it up nine years later to say let us investigate uh, if there is a cover up i think it must come to an end Uh, there are no two Kenyans there are no rich Kenyans there are no poor Kenyans the life of every Kenyan matters this is where we want to follow up as government the institutions are there the ODPP is moving they know what they are supposed to do and the British government has assured us as and when the processes run they are ready to deliver the culprits they are known and justice will be done in accordance with Kenyan laws as per the jurisdiction given to us by the DCA Kamati hiyo ya bunge ikiongozwa na mwenyekiti wake Kato Olemetito inasema ipo haja kwa wizara husika kutoa maelezo ya ndani kuhusu kwa nini kesi imechukua muda mrefu sana kukamilishwa It took the Kenyan government seven years up to 2019 while we know very well the police started investigations very early made request very early they did not make those requests after 2019 so waziri Let's not complicate the matters. Does government uh, we are here uh, before you to assure you that everything will be done to ensure that justice is done in this matter. We just want to ensure that the assurance you have given to Kenya to Kenyans that you have also met with the, your counterpart from UK has given you the assurance that the culprit will be brought to book. Mawaji ya Agnes Wanjiru yalitokea mwaka 2012. Inadaiwa Wanjiru aliuawa na afisa mmoja wa kijeshi wa Uingereza walipokuwa kijiburudisha kambini na nyuki kaunti ya Laikipia. Mwili wa Wanjiru ulipatikana katika tangi la maji. Familia ingali inalilia haki ya mwana wao. Nixon Kisaka K24 Samoja.